Hi everyone, Nikki here from Everyone 61. So I'm still taking things early, but I thought I'd do a couple of videos in one go. So yes, I have been naughty and peeked at this already because it's been sitting here for a while. Uh, it's my tonic subscription box, um, February one? Yeah, February one. And it's a really lovely kit. So if they've got any left, um, you can buy a one-off kit, but I love their kits. So let me just move some stuff to one side. So these are the papers. And if you're new to watch my channel and haven't seen a tonic unscription before, um, unboxing, I mean, um, they always put their papers in these folders and they're great. I've got a stash of them now, which I keep different things in. Um, I think there's a list somewhere of the papers, but I can't remember the colour. Um, can't read too well still at the moment. Sorry, it's right, I just can hear my dog being sweet. Uh, you're not going in my bedroom. No, 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 I'm not. Sorry about that. He's got a thing of trying to sneak in my bedroom at the moment. It's got this lovely thick cream card. And then there's this beautiful blue one, which is single-sided, but it's really thick, pretty card. And then, let me just put that there got two sheets of this which is the same on each side so you've got the dotty side and then you've got these beautiful I keep saying beautiful really pretty flowers and then there's this handmade paper as I call it embossed paper which is like a rosy pink with flowers embossed I don't know if you're going to see that too well some lovely red miri so I'm loving these colours, a bit different. And then this peachy card, which has got a texture on it. And we've got two, like a pink and cream. Love this blue. And then we've got a red. So I think this is called their Craft Perfect range, like their ordinary papers. And then you've got this great gold Miri um, glitter card. So those are the papers. So I'll just pop them in there. Because until I've used the kit at least once, I like to keep everything there. And then they also included a folder. You get this every, I think it's every three to four months. You get a folder to keep your dies in, which is great. And they're nice and sturdy. So we got that because they forgot that last month. And this is called Country Apron. So this is this kit. So I'll just take these bits out. Um, so you always get a little stamp set, I think. Um, I can't, like I said, I'm still having trouble reading some things. It says, baked with love, thanks a bunch. And then you've got like these little flowers and stuff. Happy Mother's Day, just for you. Grandma's Kitchen. And then you can put... Um, from the kitchen of so-and-so, which is nice because it's actually um, an apron die kit. Um, so you can put like that on the front if you, if you cook and stuff. Um, your special day, happy Father's Day. And then from the garden off, because it's got some garden dies, so it'll all make sense in a minute. And I can't read that one. It's your cake i don't know i can't see but anyway so you get a little set of stamps and then the dies oh if i show you that you'll be able to see what i'm on about more so you can do it as flowers um you can make it into a box as well which i've seen somebody do so i want to do that so this is one of the die sets so there's this one which cuts in and then you cut cut the outside you've got little flowers different pockets and then you've got like the utensils so you've got like the baking ones there's even barbecue ones which is great that I like that you can use it for a man as well and then you've got the main die bit another little pocket the little ribbon bit and then this is to make the box I think you cut two of them then there's like a decoration piece the oven gloves little flowers so you can do it as a gardening apron and then you've got tools for like man's DIY and yeah gardening stuff so I think that's really sweet and then these are the goodies and then it lists what's here but 
that's a bit of a blur still for me at the moment i can read some of it so yep loving that and then these are the what i call the pretty stuff so i have taken everything out the wrappers because like i said i was a bit impatient <laughs> or oh, sorry if i just knocked you let me come down a bit so you've got the, these glitters um sequins and i think somebody said on their dt team they've changed the shape of the bottles because normally they're round but they're this sort of curvy shape um let's see if i can read that something pink anyway so you've got these peachy sequins and um, then this is <laughs> i wish i could read better still like i said in my other video i can see far away great but close up is just not happening and then they've got these what are these the crystal ones to see if i can read it on here better no i can't <laughs> but anyway you've got the, i think these are their crystal accents i think in this really pretty plummy color uh, hopefully i can get to see better soon but like I said, it's only been a week, so it's still early days. And then got a glitter marker, which is fired brick. And then you've got a nouveau chalk mousse in this pretty, like tealy, minty colour. Some red ribbon, uh, chili red. I can read that. So if the print's fairly big, I can read it. Yeah, so chili red, and then. This is another sort of one of their Nouveau drops in a ready colour. Can I read that? No, I can't. California. I'm trying to make it out. I'm not going to try and make up speed. But anyway, one of these drops. This is a really good video, isn't it? This is what you can get in this kind of stuff. And then I think these are their vintage drops. Oh, no, they're not. can't see what it says. But in this lovely, like, yellowy, creamy colour so yeah that is my unboxing from tonic i know i can't read some of the stuff out hopefully next month will be better um i'll be seeing the consultant probably at the end of february beginning of march just to see how things have gone but i've got a feeling i'm probably going to need glasses for reading things which is fine i don't mind that if i have to wear glasses it doesn't bother me i've been doing that off and on since i was a kid um I didn't want to be stepping on the dog so I hope you enjoyed my unboxing if you like unboxing videos journal flips glue books um paper crafting and that sort of thing then please subscribe and I'll see you all soon bye